Karibu sana ndugu mpenzi mtazamaji wa Itika Gospel Flavor. Mimi naitwa Alex Nyagenilo. Ni wakati mzuri sana kwa kwao ambao upo sasa hivi katika runinga yako nyumbani lakini pia upo katika mitandao mbalimbali ya kijamii ukiwa unaangalia Itika Gospel Flavor. Ni wengi sana ambao walikuwa wanataka kupata hii fursa ya kuangalia kipindi hiki na kusikia neno la Mungu kupitia kwa waimbaji mbalimbali wa nyimbo za injili na kupata hili neno ambalo Mungu amenipa mimi nikwambia wewe. Kwa hiyo kama umepata nafasi hiyo ya kulisikiliza neno hilo sema asante Mungu lakini pia uitike baada ya kusikia hii sauti ikiwa nakuita uko ndani. Moja kwa moja tunaanza na nyimbo nzuri kutoka Afrika Kusini. Huyu si mwingine anaitwa Joy Praise akiwa amewashirikisha Soweto Choir. Nyimbo yao inaitwa Almighty God ni bonge la nyimbo, bonge la song. Kwa hiyo wewe ambao upo hapo nyumbani na ninayo hema ni kubwa utabarikiwa sana sana sana. Karibu.
Yo, baada ya kupata mwimbo mzuri kutoka kwa Joy Prez akiwa mashirikisha uh, Soweto Gospel Choir anaikwambia Oh my God ni mwimbo mzuri hata hapo mwenyewe nipo kana sikia uwepo wa Mungu ukiwa una tamalaki hicho ndio kitu kikubwa ambacho nakuja kukuambia lakini leo katika segment yetu ya kwanza ambayo inakuwa hook of the day au ndo ano ya siku Ndoano ya siku ya leo tunaenda kusoma neno uh, hii inatoka katika Timotheo wa pili uh, mstari wa ishiri, u, wa pili eh, Timotheo wa pili mbili ishirina mbili akwambia lakini zikimbieni tamaa za ujanani lakini zikimbieni tamaa za ujanani hapa anazungumza na kijana ambaye kila siku unaishi maisha yako ya kila siku unakula bata unafanya kila kitu ambacho unajaribu kukifanya lakini kitu kimoja ambacho anakuambia kwamba uh, thamani yako wewe kijana ni huo ujana wako lakini pia zikimbie tamaa za ujanani mimi naweza nikazungumza hapo kwa sababu hii ni blessing upon blessing lakini hapa tunaye pasta kijana ambaye atakuja ya kukwambia atakuja kukwambia hasa kijana ni nani na, na inabidi ufanye nini Mungu ameweka kusudi gani kwa wewe kijana ambaye upo sasa hivi hapo nyumbani uko unapenda kuangalia miziki na nyingine lakini tayari hapa neno la Mungu linakuambia uh, fahari za vijana ni nguvu zao kwa hiyo kama ni kijana hapo nyumbani fahari yako wewe ni nguvu zako lakini pia anakuambia zikimbieni tamaa za ujanani Unajua ujanani kuna vitu vingi sana. Watu wanakula bata na kila kitu wanajisahau kabisa kwamba hapo ulipo na hapa nilipo ni kwa neema tu. Kwa hiyo Mungu kama akiamua kusema wewe leo hautakuendelea kuwepo basi hautaendelea kuwepo. Hebu kwanza twende tukamsikilize uh, Pastor John Komanya. Huyu ni pasta na aposto ni kijana kabisa. Anakuambia kijana ukipewa nafasi ya kuona leo usijidharau. Mimi naitwa Aposto Bishop John Komanya. Mimi ni mwanamuziki ni mwanamuziki na Mungu Mungu ameniita kwenye eneo hilo akanibadilisha aka, aka, aka akaniongezea aka kitu lakini gift ambayo nimepewa ni, ni, ni amesinga na vijana wengi kama nilivyokuambia hapa amesema hivi fahari ya nini ya kijana ni nini ni nguvu zake nguvu zake wao wenyewe kwa lugha nyingine mimi naweza nikashindilia pale au Paul alichozungumzia hapo nikasema hivi kwamba ukimuona nazungumza kabisa kwa ni kijana ukimuona mchungaji he cannot lifting you he cannot challenging you he cannot put in the place that you are you need to show up who you are usipende mtu akuinue biblia inasema hivi show up jionyeshe kwamba umekubalika la kwanza nenda wewe mwenyewe kwa mwambie hivi mimi napiga mziki lakini ni rap sasa wengine wanatofautiana kwamba rap wanaiona ni dhambi rap wanaiona haujaokoka wewe una foka foka tu yani wewe hamna dalili zote no 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 that is tunasema hivi kwenye mzasa hapo ndio knowledge nyingine tunapanda ya mziki yeye anamtukuza Mungu kwa aina ya ngonjera ni kama vile hodi hodi mwanangu mlangoni tunaingia mwanangu Yesu wewe wewe si kiboko mimi nimeshakufagilia Yesu mwanaume yeye anazungumza vile ni sawa sana mimi nikaichukua hiyo message nikasema wewe ni mwanaume hakuna kama wewe alpha na omega utasimama kwa Mungu wetu yeye yeah, wewe ni Mungu sasa wengine wanaitafsiria tofauti sasa pale yeye na praise Mungu kwa, ki, kwa gift aliyopewa sasa tuna lose vijana ambao pale kanisa kwangu sasa hivi kuna timu ya mpira hapa nimeleta jezi nimemwona huyu ili nimpate ili aje kuomba ili akae vizuri anacheza mpira soka kwa lazima nichukue jezi nikaweka ili nimpate ili Mungu anipe relationship na yeye nitiendee story wengine wanakuja wana, wanasema nini kata nini k sasa ile kata k sio dhambi wewe sio wewe mchungaji sio Mungu wa kumrekebisha huyu wewe mchungaji unatakiwa kuomba Mungu amrekebishe. Sasa ile step za Mungu zimeanza tara tibu. Hivi unavyoniona mtu aweza akanyang'anya Yesu wala nikamsikiliza aje na benzi yake mimi nalipa. Alafu wewe kwa kama kijana skendo ni nyingi lazima ziwepo. Usisikilize skendo. Kwamba jamaa yule jamaa yule usisikilize skendo. Wewe angalia mpira, angalia goli. Angalia goli liko wapi una mpira. Watazungumza wewe una mpira ukira tusikia piga mpira wewe mkate una mpira kwa wapi wewe angalie kwamba maisha yangu niliyokuwa nayo lazima niwe na ofisi yangu lazima nimtukuze Mungu wangu lazima nimheshimu Mungu wangu wewe ni wa maana na lingine 
Karibu nyumba ya furaha Cathedral of Joy. I love you so much. Hiki ni kipisi tu. Nitakupa kingine. Itika. Yaani hiki kipindi mimi nimekiadmire sana. Yaani sitoke humo kwa sababu najua wewe ni wa maana. Lazima uitike. Yaani ngome ni kitua tena lazima utaitika tu. Uh, baada kumsikiliza Apostle John Komani anakuambia huyu uh, jana ni mali kubwa sana usijidharau hata kidogo na kama mtu mwingine anataka kudharau wewe mwambie wewe wote wale ambao wewe unadharau tu lakini mimi Mungu ana makusudi na mimi ndio maana ameniacha niendelee kuiona leo lakini pia napenda kukumbusha wewe ambao unatumia mitandao ya kijamii kila siku hebu fanye hivi uingie hapo hiyo ni baraka kwa sababu usipoisikia hii sauti leo na kuitika itakuwa ni kitu kikubwa sana tunasema itika gospel flavor hapa ndipo nyumbani ambapo wewe unaenda kubarikiwa tena na tena
Wanatumaini uko vizuri kabisa mtazamaji wa Itika Gospel Flavor. Mimi naitwa Alex Nyaganiro. Katika muda wote ambao umekaa nyumbani unaangalia muziki mzuri kutoka kwa waimbaji tofauti wa nyimbo za injili kutoka ndani ya Tanzania lakini pia nje ya mipaka ya Tanzania ninayo furaha kubwa na naimani kabisa utakuwa umeenjoy vya kutosha. Na moja kwa moja tunaenda kuangalia segment yetu ya pili ambayo inakuambia right time to the right person. Muda sahihi. Tunasema shida na matatizo yote tupo kule ukishaamua kuokoka na kusema Bwana Yesu ndio Bwana na mwokozi wa maisha yako wewe ndani ya Yesu unapata kila kitu kizuri unapata. Na leo nipo na brother hapo brother mambo vipi? Bwana Yesu asifiwe. Amen. Barikiwa sana. Amen. Hii ndio salamu za vijana. Ukiamua tu ukikata shauri ukimtusema Bwana Yesu ndio Bwana na mwokozi wa maisha yako tunasema Bwana Yesu asifiwe. Barikiwa sana. Hizi ndio salamu zetu kama vijana. Mimi nataka uambie watazamaji wako vijana sasa hivi ambao wanaangalia Itika Gospel Forever hapo nyumbani wakini wapo labda katika, katika vyombo mbalimbali mitandao tofauti ya kijamii eh, YouTube kwira wanaangalia sasa hivi Itika Gospel Forever. Wewe ni nani? Umetoka wapi na unafanya nini? Na kwa nini ki, nini nini hasa kilichokufanya? Kwa sababu mimi huwa naacha mambo yote ya dunia tupa kule na naingia kumtumikia Mungu liko wapi. Mimi naitwa Risha Peter Mubila. 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 Yeah. Uh -huh. <laughs> Wewe mkongo nini mzee? Ah, pana, pana, ni Tanzania. Ah, okay, tu ndio ndio ndio. Ah, niko hapa kawa. Yeah. Natoka Kansala ya huduma ya Little Living Water. Okay. Niko pale kwa aposto ndege. Ah, pasta ndege kwa sababu tumekuwa tuna tunamsikia na tunamuona mara nyingi sana amekuwa akijitokeza kuhamasisha vijana kuingia yeah. katika utumishi na hicho ndicho brother hapa anasema, eh? Ya, na mimi nafanya mziki, piga mziki, piga kinanda, sana niko pande uwa. Uwe kinanda ulijifunza lini, ya netango wanzo kupiga kinanda una miaka mingapi? Ya, nimeanza mwaka tisina tisa, kujifunza kinanda, mwajua mziki ni... Mziki kama kama zilivyo fani nyingine lazima uifanyie kazi ili yeah. izidi ku, kukua kukua hapo. Kwa nime, nimetoka mbali kwa historia ndefu hapo kiona kuanzia 99 99 mpaka leo nikaribia miaka 15 hivi. Yeah, 15 miaka mingi. Yeah. Kwa hiyo ni umri wa mtu mzima. <laughs> <laughs> Sasa niambie kwa nini kwa nini imekuwa uh, katika nyimbo za injili na sio kwenda kwenye mabendi huko mzee wa unakesha huko usiku ndo mbolo na nini na ukaamua kusema mimi ngoja nitakuwa nitaingia huko nitamtumikia Mungu nitapiga kinanda changu nitapiga nini ili nimrudishie Bwana utupupu niliko wapi kwanza kabisa niliweke tu liwazi mimi nimezaliwa katika familia ya watu wanaomjua Mungu familia yangu lakini unajua kuzaliwa sio ishu mtu ukifikia umri wa kuchagua una uhuru wa kufanya chochote unachotaka na hakuna mtu anayekuzuia so nilipofikia umri ambao sasa mimi naelewa natakiwa kuchukua njia yangu mimi ndo naelewa nilifanya maamuzi kulingana na misingi ambayo nilikuwa nimeshajiongea tangu tulipofanya nilifanya maamuzi ya kutumika kwa upande huu wokovu wokovu ni maisha wokovu ni kila kitu uh, so kila kitu kinapatikana ndani ya wokovu kwa mimi maisha yangu yote ya munda yako yako yanaelea ndani ndani ya wigo wa wokovu umemsikia ndugu mtasamaji wa itika gospel forever kwamba kila kitu kina flow under control vijana Yeye ndo mtaani tunasema hivyo kwamba ukiwa na Roho Mtakatifu ukiwa na Mungu ndani yako kila kila kile ambacho unakifanya una una, unaelea tu kwenye uwepo. Uwezi kufanya kila kitu un, unaambiwa kabisa huku unako kwenda sio na hiki unachofanya ndio. Hivyo vyote utavipata wapi? <laughs> Ni kukata tu shauri kwamba leo kuanzia leo na Yesu ndio atakuwa Bwana na mwokozi wa maisha yangu kama brother Elisha hapa amefanya. Huyu ni kijana Elisha ameamua kumtumikia Mungu na anakuambia yeye blessing upon blessing. Misele yote kwa Yesu ani. Sasa unazigua zingua hapo unafanya vitu vyako. Hapana, umefanya vitu vingine lakini kila kitu kipo nyumbani kwa Bwana kwa sababu anasema fedha na fedha na thahabu vyote ni mali ya Bwana. Kwa hiyo kila kitu unachokiona kizuri kinachotamaniwa na mataifa ukiingia nyumbani kwa Bwana wewe unapata tu. Kwa hiyo kama pamba kali nini unataka sema mikaushio mikali watoto mtaani hapana wewe enjoy nyumbani kwa Bwana hicho kitu chote utakipata. Elisha, wewe nadhani ni kitu gani hasa ambacho vijana wanakosa 
mpaka uh, tunaona wanatumkia kwenye mambo mabaya kabisa ambayo yanaharibu baada yao lakini pia inaharibu hata maisha yao wenyewe na jamii ambayo inawazunguka ni kitu gani ambacho unadhani kama vijana wa mtaani wanakikosa kitu ambacho kinakosekana ni kitu kimoja tu Yesu ndani ya mtu kwa sababu mtu asipokuwa na Yesu kitu ambacho kinakuwa kinamuendesha ndicho kinacho kinamsababishia kina anajikuta kwa kwenye mazingira kama haya kwa hicho tu ndio naweza kusema kinakosekana ndani ya mtu kwa sababu labda wewe na mimi tuko hivi tulivyo hatuko kama wale kwa sababu ya Yesu ulipokubali na Yesu alishafanya kazi yote Al, alichofanya ni kututafutia tu sasa alitutengenezea kila kitu ila kazi aliyotuachia ni moja tu kusema naam nimekubali naam nimekubali ah <laughs> <laughs> uh, umesikia ndugu mpenzi mtazamaji wa Itika Gospel Flavor yes walifanya kila kitu kila kitu kilikowapoa cha msingi tu kimoja ambacho kilibaki wewe hapo ambao unaangalia sasa hivi Itika Gospel Flavor labda upo katika mitandao ya kijamii upo YouTube upo labda Facebook unaangalia Itika Gospel Flavor kitu kimoja nakwambia kilichobaki ni wewe tu kusema naam bwana nakuja The right time to the right person muda sahihi umemmsikiliza brother Irisha anakuambia yeye tangu mdogo amekuwa katika familia ya Kristo amelelewa hivyo that's why ameamua ikafika siku aka, akaisikia sauti ya bwana ikimuita akaitika kama wewe ambavyo sasa hivi ambapo upo nyumbani inabidi uitike baada ya kuisikiliza na kusikiliza neno la Mungu ambalo Mungu amepanda ndani yetu ili tukwambie wewe ambao sasa hivi unaangalia TV yako nyumbani Itika Gospel Flavor ndio sehemu yako. Kitu kikubwa ambacho nataka nikuambie sasa hivi, sikuachi hivi hivi katika segment hii ya muda sahihi. Na kuacha na brother mmoja anaitwa Chris anakuambia Victorias. Bonge la ngoma. Lakini pia usisahau kutembelea www.itika.blogspot.com kwa ajili ya kupata taarifa zote na information zote ambazo zinohusiana na Itika kwamba tumetembelea wapi, tumepiga story na akina nani, picha na kila kitu tutasipata hapo ni Itika Gospel Flavor. Like the feds and them city cops on me They giving chase but I fled and still got the rock on me This is as real as it gets and I'll say it many ways I'm a renegade who ain't been afraid of the center stage Most of the men in the church sweeter than lemonade And about as useful as a hand grenade made of mayonnaise I pray the father would use me until my hair is gray And my hands decay from the work I did in the Savior's name Good will forever be I am more than a And I'm not ever stopping I'll forever be Good will forever be I am more than a I'm not ever stopping Cause I'll forever be My proximity closer to God Literally, I done played the back for a minute Beyond memory Yo, I'm an eagle, the enemy warm pigeon me My flight way out of sight Beyond vision me I'm the epitome of the Father's delivery My sound liberty break chains eventually It's fantastic from Grand Rapids to Manhattan They selling sci-fi rap fam Pan's Labyrinth What I spit real, no cameras but all action With all facets, he draws masses The Lord's massive I just wanna be ready, oil in my lantern Clean from the inside, spiritual my lanta I'm growing in the Lord, no bottles and no pampers And I release the junk of my life Fresh Sanford, it never made sense Christ paying this man's ransom When I was just as foul as a free throw And one I'm 
important, I'm not ignored and I am anointed And every word I speak it releases to save his ointment Just like a date was set for my trouble to come upon me There's an appointment with joy and freedom that's in the morning My body's healed, I am no longer nobody's shield This is the season for doing me cause nobody will If it was up to them I'd probably be in the lobby still With a shotty to your body like running through no drill I went from selling O's to green trying to cake up To spitting heavy flows until the zombies are wake up Only God can realize there's Israel inside of Jacob I lay aside the weight so that I could become the waiter We are so obsessed with the work of our Lord and Savior That we neglect the Lord of the work like I see you later Pencil in the appointment for prayer and then the race him Then you want success like the Lakers when you're a pacer Just for what he's done, you're my faith you can never waver And God will forever be And I am more than a And I'm not ever stopping Cause I'll forever be And God will forever be sio jambo jepesi kuwa barua iliyo wazi kwa mataifa kama kijana unasimama popote tutakaposimama unasema mimi nimeokoka na mpenda Yesu Yesu ndio bwana na mwokozi wa maisha yangu sio jambo jepesi ni, ni kama vita hivi lakini hivyo vita tayari yaani yupo ambaye alitushindia pale msalabani unasema pale Golgotha kila kitu kilimalizika yani kwa hiyo cha msingi kama umeshampokea umeitika na ukasema leo nasema Yesu Kristo ndio bwana na mwokozi wa maisha yangu ilisha kila kitu pale kwa hiyo shida na matatizo tupa kule unachapa mwendo unaenda mbele yani mpaka mbinguni mwendo mdundo unajua anasema you are not alone hauko peke yako kuna vitu vingi sana ambavyo unakaa hapo nyumbani labda unasema mimi ninazo shida nayo matatizo makubwa sifahamu namna ya kuyatatua matatizo yangu leo katika itika gospel forever katika segment hii hapa ya you are not alone hauko peke ni kuna brother zangu hapa brother mambo vipi fresh Eh? Bwana Yesu asifiwe. Amina. Barikiwa sana. Sana tu. Sikia kijana anakuambia Amina, barikiwa sana. Bas sijui hapo ni blessing upon ni blessing. Tendo kitu kikubwa. Brother, mimi naomba uniambie, wewe jina lako unaitwa nani kwa? Naitwa Elia. Mr. Elia. Elia mtishibi eh au mgali laya. Tishibi. Najua tena. Elia mtishibi kama unasoma sana Biblia mtafute Elia mtishibi huyu jamaa alikuwa ni nabii hivi sio eh? Hatari sana. Hatari sana. Noma. Yeah. <laughs> Brother hapo jina lako unaitwa nani? Bwana mimi naitwa Damas Mgera. Mr. Damas Mgera. Yes. Eh bwana itika gospel forever. Ni kipindi cha vijana ambao tunazungumzana vijana. Sasa leo katika uh, segment hii hapa ya hauko pekee you are not alone. Nataka nizungumze na vijana mambo mengi. Elia. Mm. Hivi kwa niki, nini kwanza kikufanya wewe mpaka uko uko? Ah, ni swali gumu na ni swali zuri. Eh. Yeah. Kwa ni, ni ni choice ya mtu. Yeah. Au ushikii bunduki au ushikii wala pango wala pango wala pango. Kisha fika stage ukaona anamhitaji Mungu mwenye tunasalimu. Kio na mambo ya end ya fanya nini unafanya. Kwa mambo ya stack ya nilifika sehemu ya kastaki kabisa mzee. Unajua computer kisha stack haitaki yani uweze kupunguza button yoyote. Ni mpaka uli start tena kwa hiyo nikaamua ni restart kwa hiyo. Da nakumbuka ilikuwa ni kama 2004 hivi. Unajua Mungu anapotaka kukuokoa anapotaka kukubadilisha kama alivyosema aliye ku start. Yeye huwa ndo mwenye mpango kwa sababu sisi hatumchagua yeye ndo anatuchagua yes. lakini sisi tunashauriana mimi kwa 2004 nilikuwa kulikuwa na mkutano jangwani pale sasa nilimpeleka rafiki yangu alikuwa na kidonda hivi kijana mzangu sio kidonda kile ukimweka dawa dakika kumi wadudu wanatoka kila dakika kumi wadudu wanatoka kasikia kisa kwamba hospitali kwambia huyu hawezi kupona sasa kulikuwa na mobile fulani anaitwa Charles kutoka Kenya kwenda pale akaombewa alipoombewa yule jamaa akaambiwa kirudi nyumbani ufungue hicho kitambaa Kodi nyumbani kweli kufungua kitamba hata alama ya kovu hamna. Ah, Nikawaza. Kweli kumbe Mungu yupo eh? Kwa hiyo kumbe Mungu naye matatizo yangu nilo nayo anaweza kanisaidia. Unajua unaweza ukawa kijana una maswali 1000 afu na hata jibu moja. Yeah. Nikawaza nikasema huyu mm, aliyemponya kidonda huyu na mimi anaweza. Bas siku ya pili nikaenda 
nani anataka kumpokea Yesu? Nikatoka mbele. Kwa hiyo nimeona mabadiliko mpaka leo maisha yangu yako vizuri yani. Unaonaje? Tangu ile siku ya kwanza kuokoka kumpokea Bwana Yesu kwa Bwana na mwokozi wa maisha yako eh, na maisha ya nyuma kabla hujamoku. Kabla kipindi hujaokoka. Mabadiliko ni mengi sana. Mabadiliko ni mengi kwa sababu nyuma zaidi nilikuwa nikiishi kutumia akili yangu. Nakumbuka akili yangu haina majibu ya kutosha kwangu. Lakini baada ya kuja upande wa pili kwa Yesu sasa hapa nina akili mbili maana yake ya kwangu na nina ya Mungu ambayo yenyewe ndio inayoniongoza na ya Mungu siku zote iko sahihi kuliko ya kwangu. Kwa kuna vitu ambavyo nikitaka kufanya ile akili ya Mungu ile naniambia hichi sio sahihi kwa sababu kitakurudisha uliko kuwa unatoka kwa sababu zamani nilikuwa na mtu mmoja na maswali 1000 afu sinajibu. Lakini sasa hivi hata kama nikiwa na maswali milioni moja, mjibuji naye kwa sababu yeye anajua kabla mimi sija kuwepo yeye anajua. Kwa hiyo ninaposa ah hii inakuwaaje? Kwa hivyo mimi nilikuwa nashia sana mimi nitachaje kupenda mademu. Yaani hiyo ndio ilikuwa shida yangu kubwa sana mimi kama kijana. Ah bwana mimi nilikuwa mwizi. Mzee yaani kila ukiona kitu mzee inakwambia sasa siondoke nacho. Ndani kama mamaangu mdogo atakuwa anashuhudia hili. Atakuwa ananiona na nazungumza na najua nini nini ninachokizungumzia. Ndio. Kwa sababu ilikuwa unajua zile 200 mia ngapi mia nane. <laughs> Zisikai mezani yani mzee. Mzee unatoka nazo. Ya na na, na Biblia inasema kwamba dhambi yoyote ikikaa na ikikomaa ina dhaa mauti. Ya yeah, ya. Yeah. Kwa mauti ya dhambi inatokana na hilo naanza 200 mia nane, atakuja mtu 100 200 milioni moja ambao ningekuwa na kunja benki sasa hizi. Mbali sinakuja na komando na dhaa mauti hapo. <laughs> Hawa ni vijana tulikuwa nao hapa tunazungumza nao mambo mengi you are not alone hauko peke yako hata wewe hapo nyumbani sasa hivi hauko peke yako kuna wenzako kama hawa ambao walikuwa huko walipita huko sana lakini Yesu akawaokoa jamaa alikuwa mdokosi yani asione 200 mezani imepo imeenda yani jamaa asione tu sketi ni issue lakini baada ya ku baada ya kuokoka eh, kumpokea Yesu kukili Yesu kuwa bwana na mwokozi wa maisha yao maisha amebadilika kabisa. Kwa hiyo hata wewe hapo sasa hivi kijana ambaye unaangalia Itika Gospel Forever ni wakati wako mzuri pia wa kuchukua hatua baada ya kuhubiriwa na kusikia miziki ya aina ya muziki wewe ambao unausikia. Unajua kabisa kwamba hapa lipo jambo ambalo inabidi nilifanye. Naomba uniambie neno lako la mwisho kwa vijana ambao wanaangalia sasa hivi Itika Gospel Forever wanaangalia you are not alone. Unawaambia nini? Mstelia. Nabii mtishibi Elia. Ya, namba leo ni sije kama nabii maana kija kama nabii itakuwa hatari. <laughs> Mimi naambia watu wamkubali Yesu, kuna maisha ndani ya Yesu. Kuna maisha ndani ya Yesu. Elia anakuambia kuna maisha ndani ya Yesu. Brother hapo Mgera unasemaje? Mimi ni washauri vijana wazangu, kwa Yesu kuna kila kitu. Yaani kwa Yesu kuna fashion zote. Yaani maujanja yote, yote ambayo yapo kwa Yesu. Swaga nini zote Yaani kila kitu kama hip hop kwa Yesu tunazo, yeah. bongo flavor kwa Yesu tunazo. Unaona? Yaani kila unachota, yaani kile kile ambacho tunawashauri tu atoke kule kwa sababu kule hawako eneo sahihi kwa wakati sahihi. Lakini wanapokuja huko watakuwa wako eneo sahihi kwa wakati sahihi kwa sababu huko kuna kila kitu ni sahihi. Huko hamna majuto wala kuna lawama. Hii ni full shango kwa upande huu hapa kila kitu kinapatikana kwa hiyo kama unapenda hip hop unapenda R&B unapenda reggae unapenda aina yoyote ile ya muziki tatizo mahala ulipo sio mahala sahihi upande wa pili kuna kila kitu na huku ndio mahala sahihi kwamba unapata faraja hapa lakini pia huko nako pia unakoenda unaenda kufarijika pia Uh, Tumeni langu ndugu mpenzi mtazamaji utakuwa umefurahi umeenjoy vya kutosha hii ninasema baraka juu ya baraka itika gospel flavor kipindi chako wewe kijana ambao upo nyumbani unasikiliza neno la Mungu kupitia waimbaji mbalimbali wa nyimbo za injili kutoka ndani ya Tanzania lakini pia nje ya mipaka ya Tanzania hii ni kwa neema tu ukiona umepata baraka ya kuiona leo wapo wengi sana walitamani waione leo lakini hawakupata hiyo fursa kuiona leo kwa kama umepata fursa ya kuiona leo ndio wakati wako mzuri sasa wa kusema hebu ngoja niitike kwanza nikamsikilize Mungu wangu ananiita anataka aniambie nini. Kwa hiyo ili upate kujua kwamba Mungu anakuambia ni, ni wakati wako mzuri wa kuangalia Itika Gospel Forever. Nashukuru sana. Ilikuwa ni dakika 30 nzuri. Baraka juu ya baraka. Nasema blessing upon blessing. Watu wote naamini kabisa mtakuwa mmefurahi, mmeenjoy vya kutosha. Tuonane tena muda unaofuata tena. Mjuma lingine 
hapa hapa wala hata usitoke katika itike gospel flavor lakini pia napenda kutambua uwepo wa wa cameraman wangu Mohamed Njakani self side wote ambao wamesababisha uh, hii kitu kuwa vizuri wamebarikiwa walikuwa na nguvu za kutosha wamefanya kazi kwa juhudi na energy kubwa Mungu awabariki sana lakini pia napenda kutambua uwepo wa dereva wangu uh, Baba Ridwani e, popote ambapo mimi nataka Mungu ana anamuongoza ana amegeuka Mungu kuwa dereva wa gari yetu kwa popote ambapo tunafika Mungu ana anaendesha ana, ana tuendo na kuwa dereva wetu na tunafika salama kabisa lakini pia napenda kutambua uh, mchango mkubwa ambao nimepewa na Picolo Beach Hotel hapa sehemu ambapo nipo ndio hapo ambao wao wamenipa kwambia hapana kwa sababu nazungumza neno la Mungu na inaenda kuwa bariki wengine basi haina bodi ufanyie hapa hao ndo watu muhimu sana 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 ambao wanaweza kuwashukuru lakini mwisho wa siku nasema asante sana Mungu kunipa hii karama ya kusema na watanzania wenzangu na dunia nzima kupitia itika gospel flavor siwaachi hivi hivi ngoja kwanza nikwambie ni nyimbo gani ambao tunaenda kumaliza naye tunaenda kumaliza naye nyimbo ya triple re anakwambia am god I'm God. Ndipewa fursa na nafasi ya kumtumikia Mungu kwa uaminifu na kuwa barua iliyo wazi kwa mataifa. Ndio hivyo. Mungu anakupa upako juu ya upako. Blessing upon blessing. Mimi naitwa Alex Nyaganero. Karibu sana. I hear the troubles coming for me, death is at my doorway Fear says I'm a parish bro, but that ain't what my lord say He said I ain't guilty at all, I still ain't had my court day Taste it and I've seen them even know it's just a four day I don't know what they feeling, I don't know what they thinking Bro, my soul's invincible like Mario when he blanket Hey, hey, they see me full of joy like I don't know what he drinking Cup is full of living water, bro, I sip it and thank him Yes, sir, might not win a Grammy or get another Stella, but I'll get rewards from my Lord, it ain't nothing better I might not draw it again, I might not send a million But I've been purchased by my king, he's forever with me So, so what they talking about? No, they can't knock me down Yes sir, I do feel pain, but Jesus got me now That's why I'm making noise, that's why I'm running hard That's why I go gorilla, spitting the monkey bars Partner, you know I'm good to go Pressure creates diamonds and fire and fires of gold Ain't nothing on this planet to satisfy my soul I'm living for tomorrow, today is out of control For sure, I'm good Take out my money, I'm good Here come the pain, I'm good Yeah, they can kill me, I'm good Check that's game, I'm good I ain't seen and we don't feel any pain I'm the same, you can't take us out the game Cause only we good I done been through the fire, I survived all the floods And them riders that's with me They all covered in blood, drag my name through the mud They get hate, they get gossip, but my passion for Jesus They ain't never gon' stop it, I was dead I guess that made me better than I ever was Look at me, I'm good, partner, I'm on my forever buzz If everything I have is taken, I can take it They say I never make it, I know the person who made it My life is hidden in them, so when I die, I gain And Jesus really be walking with me, so how I'm lame? My life full of pain, problems and such But I'm focused on forever and eternity's touch While the world try to fight me, Pharisees try to stole me I am Tebow in the fourth quarter, they can't hold me Yeah, the Lord is my coach, got me off in the zone Tell my mama that I'm good when he carry me home I'm good, I know you know I'm good to go Pressure creates diamonds and fire and fires of gold Ain't nothing on this planet to satisfy my soul I'm living for tomorrow, today is out of control For sure, I'm good Take out my money, I'm good Here come the pain, I'm good Yeah, they can kill me, I'm good Take that's game, I'm good I ain't seen and we don't feel any pain I'm the same, you can't take us out the game Cause homie, we good And then we been beat down yeah. We been persecuted, laughed at, ridiculed and mocked yeah. But that ain't gon' stop us, man. No, sir, you know what We ain't. good. <laughs> we know our eternal resting yeah. place is at. You feel me? Hey, Trip, talk to him, man. Yeah. I know that I'ma suffer that alone. It make me tougher. Death is just a doorway to take me to my faithful lover. The lover of my soul's with me. You can shake the brother, but you never knock me down and take me under. Bring the thunder. Let the storms come to hide us and hurt us. They can't take our Lord from us, bro. We gotta subvert it. Not guilt, not guilt. He's with us and he stays present. He never leaves me. He even gives me stage presence. I know you know I'm good to go. Pressure creates diamonds and fire and fires of gold. 